It can be hard enough trying to buy a house in Nashville, especially if you're on a fixed income. But it can be just as hard holding on to a home if your age and finances keep you making necessary repairs. Our Tracy Cornett looked at efforts not only preserving Nashville's communities, but protecting the elderly homeowners living there. The way Kevin Rankins describes his North Nashville neighborhood. It's real safe. I leave the doors unlocked. I got the greatest neighbors. And most of the people who live here has been living here for quite a while. They take care of you. Makes you understand why he doesn't want to leave his home. I grew up here. But over the last five years, health issues prevented him from making some home repairs. And eventually, a water leak rotted his bathroom floor. Anybody walking in, they, everyone was scared they were going to fall in. They're vulnerable in a lot of ways. Keith Branson is the executive director of Westminster Home Connection. The organization helps older or disabled Nashvillians like Kevin preserve their homes. We can save a home for about $3,000, which is a tiny fraction of the cost of a new home. Westminster believes repairing these homes not only serves the homeowner's needs, but also helps fight the affordable housing crisis in Davidson County. They're able to function in their home and stay in it, which is what most everyone wants to do. Staying in their home means not needing housing assistance. The Metropolitan Nashville Development and Housing Agency offers about 1,400 apartments specifically for people over 62 years old or disabled. But they say the wait list can get up to 500 applicants long. <laughs> Westminster says they preserve nearly 250 homes a year through a wide range of projects, from repairing handrails on porches, replacing rotting windows, to plumbing and flooring repairs, like those at Kevin's home. Yeah, there's a big problem around affordable housing, but there's also hope in affordable repairs and being able to preserve homes that are just with a few things for a few dollars that can be saved. Their improvements, Kevin says, provides an instant morale boost. Zero to 60. <laughs> Zero to 60. Well, Westminster says the guys you saw in that video are skilled employees, but they do offer volunteer projects where everyday people like you and my, Marius, can help <laughs> on the smaller repairs. Oh, Tracy, great story. Thank you so much.